Hello, beautiful, and welcome to this week's. Well, not really a week because I'm doing monthly. So this month, monthly plan with me. So we are using our new kits, our Cotton Candy Sky. I just love the pinks and the cloud. It just reminds me of cotton candy. But I could tell you straight off right now that this video is gonna be a hot mess because there were a lot of things that I messed up on and I just like gave up at the end. But you know what? Being creative, there's no right and wrong and it's a process of learning, right? So I am also learning too. I'm not a pro at this and I learn on my way. As you can tell here, I'm gonna show you how I do not write perfectly. I really never liked my handwriting and you know, the first attempt, eh, fail. I'm gonna try it again to spell the word February in cursive and did not like it. So another fail. So therefore I did waste two <laughs> stickers already. So the third third try was a bit nerve wracking because I was like, I gotta get this right. If not, then I don't know what I'm gonna do. And so yes, at the beginning already a hot mess. <laughs> I'm just gonna add the borders of the top header washi, the bottom washies, and the sidebar. So I know for sure that from my first monthly in January, I wanted my wash bottom wash to be straight through. No cuts, no nothing. I just want to make it a clean line. So therefore my sidebar will have to be adjusted and that's why I had to peel out again that monthly header sticker in order to make room for my sidebar sticker. And obviously my day is not going well or filming with this. It was going down crooked. So I was just holding my breath, hoping that I do not rip this long piece of sticker and try to do in another angle that I could see better that it's going to be straight. Now with our monthly kits, we include 20 square box stickers. So these stickers could use all over your calendar. Um, mainly I covered the dates that aren't in the month. So I am doing that right now. I also use those square stickers for important dates that's happening in this month that I know, like for example, Valentine's Day and my daughter's birthday and her birthday party and family day and days that doesn't have school. So those days I do like to highlight with my squares. And as you can see, once it's highlighted or with the square on top of its box, it covers the date. So therefore I'm going to go back using my Claire foil date dots and just put in the dates, the missing dates. And ta-da, here it is, all filled out. Um, I put washi lines because of my parental schedule that I have with the children's father. So I know which days they are with me and which weekends they are with me. Um, it's just easier to the eye. Before I was just initialing our name on it and it just didn't look um, clean, I guess you could say. But yes, I liked January whereas <laughs> The month of February was definitely a hot mess. I don't know if you guys could see also, but the title, um, the headers where the weeks are, I made a boo-boo on that and had to cover with foil stickers. So because they are foil clear stickers, you could still see through the boo-boo. So as you can see, it was a hot mess. I know it wasn't too much of a hot mess, but to me, that's a hot mess. Maybe it was a hot mess because I wasn't really focusing on what I was doing. My children was actually in the background talking to me and being silly. If you guys want to hear how things goes behind the scene, just watch the following. Can people hear you? No. Why do you not do the talking one? Do you want to do Hi, Grandma. Hi. 